Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the third episode of Dramatic Readings from the Internet. Absolutely delicious. Tonight, we're going to be reading Half-Life, Full Life Consequences 2, What Has Toby Done? Now, let us begin. John Freeman walked like the speed of light back to his motorcycle and left behind the bad place behind him. John Freeman had to ride his motorcycle really fast back to the office, but John Freeman's gas ran out. John Freeman jumped fast off the motorcycle and landed on dead people's hands. Gordon Freeman is now these hands. I must kill the next boss and live up to full life consequences. John Freeman said out loud. John Freeman picked up a laser gun and aimed it at trees to see if he could. John Freeman shot and a tree fell down in front of him. John Freeman seen eggs fall out of the tree and he put them back home safe. These birds don't have to see Gordon Freeman yet. It's not time, John Freeman said to him. John Freeman had to walk faster and was back at his office work and on his computer. On a, a computer, pardon. He looked on the internet and found the next boss. I know his weakness now, John Freeman said, and after that he got emails from someone. John Freeman opened up the emails and read them. Dear John Freeman, how are you? I miss you at home, come home safe and soon with Gordon Freeman for Thanksgiving dinner. Love, Mom. John Freeman looked at it and got sad and yelled, I will kill the boss and Gordon Freeman will be a happy soul. Then he turned on off the computer and went on the platform again down to his more faster motorcycle that had gas in it this time. John Freeman put the laser gun on his motorcycle and his machine gun and his rocket gun that he found on the side of the motorcycle. He went through traffic and went fast like lightning to back to Ravenholm and back to the bad place where Gordon Freeman was. John Freeman went off road and did backflips and landed on back wheels but kept going too. John Freeman went really fast again like before and was soon back at Ravenholm but saw more zombie ghosts. John Freeman said to them, Zombie ghosts, I have killed your friends at the old house and I don't want to shoot your heads. Move near the countryside and you will be friends of John Freeman. And the zombie ghost said that, No, we will kill you and walked fast to John Freeman's motorcycle. John Freeman waited until they were in front of his motorcycle and backflipped off his bars and shot heads below and landed and walked fast to where the next boss was. Follow me for a moment. You will be one of us, yelled the dead zombie ghosts. John Freeman laughed and shot a rocket at them. John Freeman saw the next boss far down the road and walked slow this time. He walked really slow, like a turtle, and sat down on a rock and watched the next boss near the dead last boss and where the place that John Gordon Freeman was. The next boss was laughing at John Freeman, so John Freeman said, You will not laugh at me, and shot a rocket at him, since that was his weakness. The next boss died, and John Freeman was happy. He walked over to the dead bosses and put them under the ground and planted pants on them, so instead of messy dirt and dark, there are pretty things now to there to be happy. John Freeman walked where Gordon Freeman was lying dead and crushed from the next boss's feet and looked down. A tear dropped out of John Freeman's eye and landed on Gordon Freeman. You are dead, bro, and I killed the evil boss, John Freeman told Gordon Freeman. Then John Freeman saw something bad. A head crab was on Gordon Freeman. Gordon Freeman standed up and said, John Freeman! You got here slow, and now I am zombie ghost. You will pay. To be continued. And that concludes this episode of Dramatic Readings from the Internet. I do hope you enjoyed yourself as always, and I, as always, did enjoy of utmost top of my abilities reading to you. Good evening, and thank you for tuning in.